e-bikes ride a fine line between innovation and amusement. They blend practicality with a touch of novelty. With their modest top speeds that keep things safe but leisurely, a gentle approach to fitness, and unique designs that can range from sleek to quirky, e-bikes offer a different take on getting around town. If you're thinking of riding into the modern world of e-bikes, you should know this. The electric bike debate is sort of a love or hate relationship. So before buying one, you need to decide if electric bikes are ridiculous or revolutionary. I'm Lisa at eBiking Today, and in this e-bike debate, we're looking at what's e-bike fiction versus fact challenging what it means to pedal into the future. Let's debate, is this fiction or fact? Range anxiety. It's the fear that your e-bike will run out of juice mid-journey, leaving you to pedal home with the added weight of a dead battery. It's like going on a 500 mile road trip and realizing halfway that you forgot to fill up the gas tank. Except in this case, there's no gas station, just your own tears of regret. Fact, range anxiety might sound scary, but it's all about perspective. Most e-bikes offer a range that's more than sufficient for daily commutes and leisurely rides. Popular e-bikes from electric, rad power bikes, 10 ways, and Aventon have a riding range of up to 50 plus miles. And for adventurous riders, it's a chance to plan and explore new routes, charging their bikes at Tesla and EV charging stations, fire stations, or even a friendly restaurant. After all, e-bike life is a journey, not a destination. Further, you can get an e-bike with dual batteries, or you can take along an extra battery on long rides. The Fitness Paradox E-bikes are marketed as a great way to get exercise, but let's be real, the only thing getting a workout is your thumb on the throttle. It's like going to the gym and just sitting on the stationary bike. Are you burning calories or just your thumb as you search social media? Fact, critics say e-bikes are for the lazy, but let's pedal back for a second. E-bikes make cycling accessible to a broader range of people, including those with physical limitations or those who are new to exercise. Plus, it's easy to get a tough workout if you want one. Just turn off pedal assist and use your own pedal power on a bike that weighs three to four times more than a regular bike. Who's the fitness guru now? Danger lurks. Electric bikes are dangerous, lithium batteries are dangerous, and e-bike riders are dangerous. Fact. Like any technology, knowing how to use it properly provides safety. Electric bikes are no different. Learning how to take care of your e-bike and its battery is essential. Read the manual and learn the proper care of e-bike batteries. I've listed helpful articles and videos in the description below this video. As for any cyclist, following the rules of the road are essential. As e-bike riders, we can be cautious and respectful of others while riding, minimizing danger to ourselves and others. The price tag. E-bikes can cost as much as a used car, which is ironic considering they're just bicycles with a battery strapped on. It's like buying a designer handbag that's the same as a regular handbag, but with a fancy logo. But hey, who needs rent money when you can have an e-bike, right? Fact. Yes, e-bikes can be pricey up front, but think of it as an investment in your health, the environment, and your overall happiness. Plus, when you factor in the savings on gas, parking, and public transport, an e-bike is the most economical ride in town. As for cost, with increased competition, many e-bikes are now priced around $1,000 or less. Check below the video for a list of value-oriented e-bikes from quality brands like Ride One Up and Aventon. The Fashion Statement E-bikes come in all shapes and sizes, but let's not ignore the elephant in the room. 
Some of them look like they were designed by a committee of clowns. With their chunky frames and bulky batteries, riding one can feel like you're straddling a small refrigerator. But hey, beauty is in the eye of the beholder, right? Fact. All right, so some e-bikes have a unique look, but isn't that part of their charm? They're the avant-garde of the biking world, pushing boundaries and turning heads. Plus, with an array of designs hitting the market, there's an e-bike to suit every taste. The Superior Speed Demon. Riding your e-bike at the speed of a motorcycle, you zoom through the crowds of people on the beach boardwalk, wind in your hair, feeling like a superhero. You whisk past a cyclist on a regular bike because you have something to prove. And they don't deserve respect for riding such a slow bike anyway, right? Fact. Sure, electric bikes can go pretty fast, but most e-bikers don't feel superior to those riding a standard bicycle. Rather, e-bike riders highly respect the dedication of cyclists to their sport. But the beauty of e-bikes lies in their ability to make commuting and recreational riding manageable for the rest of us. We get to ride farther and see more of the world around us. Let's wrap up the electric bike debate. Electric bikes might have their quirks, but they're far from ridiculous. They're a testament to human ingenuity, offering a greener, healthier, and more enjoyable way to navigate our world. So let's celebrate the e-bike for what it truly is, a revolution on two wheels. Now, the only thing left to debate is whether you should hop on your ridiculous e-bike and enjoy your revolutionary ride today or tomorrow. Enjoy your ride.